Well, good morning, everybody. All oh, the duckies just love this pond. They swam in it all day yesterday, in and out, in and out, in and out, and they were doing it until dark, and I said, okay, it's time for bed, guys. Come on, out of the pond. They absolutely loved our pond. And yes, George is preening right now. He just got out of the pond and the duckies went in. Yep, everything in paradise, everything in life has a pecking order. Yeah, the deer have a pecking order. Yep, if one young buck is eating at a corn pile and a bigger buck wants that corn, he just steps up and the little one steps out of the way because he's already learned. Everything's got a pecking order. And around here, <laughs> Layla is the boss right under me. George is right under her. She had to establish that because George used to be right under me. Yeah. When we got Layla, she was just a puppy, and she had to assert herself and take a position. George gets out of her way if she wants something. Yep. And everybody else gets out of George's way. <laughs> George is number three, but he's, he acts like he's number one. Yep. In fact, every now and then he challenges me. Yesterday, Layla and Jerry were having fun, but that was an important thing. Jerry had spent 10 minutes chasing Layla, and I was laughing. I was digging a ditch and burying an electric line, and I finally said, I have to get this on video and share it. But Jerry was chasing Layla all over the yard and she decided that it was time to assert herself. And she and Jerry were having fun just like Layla does with the duckies. Yeah, but Jerry, <laughs> Ma Mama Layla has been taking care of Jerry since he was a little bitty thing, not even as big as his head is now. Yeah, and she's been licking his face ever since we got him. She licks George's face and makes him crazy, but she does it. Yeah, Mama Layla is got her place in this crew, and Jerry is like a young man in puberty testing his dad's patience. Yeah. Anyway, he's been testing his position even though he's bigger than she is. She's still the boss. Yep. Anyway, yesterday that was fun. I enjoyed watching them. Only one person had an issue with it, <laughs> which is surprising. I didn't have more, but only one yesterday. And I assure you, Jerry and Layla lay down next to each other and take a break when they're doing that. Yeah. Anyway, you see the duckies in and out of the water. Yep, they come out of the water, they do a couple of big birds, and they go right back in. Right back to having fun. Yeah. Anyway, I just made some measurements for building a dock. Yep, I got to get some boards. Now I'm going to start building the dock because I want to attach the electric line, which I buried yesterday. See, we're going to do big birds. Oh, thank you, Larry. Yep. Anyway, I buried the electric line right here last night, and it's buried clear up underneath the house. I threw plenty of extra line up under the house, and I'll get all the stuff done out here, the boxes mounted on the end of it, before I attach it to the electric. There's no point in it until then. 
Yeah. Anyway, we have blue skies in paradise. Yeah, it's a beautiful day. I'm afraid to tell you what our temperatures are. We were 48 degrees this morning, and our high today is 71 with blue skies. This is good working weather. Thoughts and prayers to <laughs> I saw there were earthquakes in California. Yeah, forest fires in lots of places. Floods going up the East Coast now. Florida is already airboat country. And now it's making airboat country all the way up the East Coast. Anyway. Oh, and congratulations to all the competitors at the Olympics. No matter where they were from, if they came out of there with a medal, they're in the top three in the world. You bet. Anyway, the United States did good. France, everybody did good. Yup. Anyway, God bless you all. Thoughts and prayers for everybody that needs them. I just thought I'd show you the duckies just love their pond. And yes, George uses it. Yep. He's standing out there preening right now. Yep, he just got out of the water. Anyway, and I just got done reinforcing my bird shelf. Yes, I had to beef it up this morning. I had to add screws to it. Yeah, it's not designed for a 30-pound hummingbird. No. <laughs> they like to sit up there because I sit at the counter right inside, and that's where I ate my dinner last night. And by the way, Betsy, you missed a good one. I made liver and onions with bacon. Oh, it was good. I'll put a picture on the community page and all the people that love liver are going to be going, oh, man, we missed a good one. Anyway, and no, Dennis, I didn't have asparagus. I had green beans. Anyway, love you all. Oh, I can't wait till this one blooms. Oh, and the one that's behind the flower pot boat out front. Oh, the big red ones. They're opening up. I'll get pictures of them. Anyway, love you all. Have a wonderful Wednesday. Yes. Oh, and I got to remind myself, on Friday is Cindy from Ohio. is her 62nd birthday. Oh, I, I still remember Cindy. Ha <laughs> ha. But uh, remind me anyway on Friday. Yep. Love you all. Remember, stay safe. Wash your flippers off and have a wonderful day. Love you. Bye.